Alright, hey guys, it is Chris here again with another video, and in this video today we're going to be taking a look at the state of New Jersey as a whole. Now yes guys, it was just announced today that not one, not two, not three, but four Kmart stores will be closing within the state of New Jersey within the next three or four months. Now the article that we have here today um, is from New Jersey 101.5, and we're going to read over it. So it says, uh, Kmart to close five, uh, four stores in the state of New Jersey. Four Kmart stores will close in New Jersey, leaving only seven stores in the state. The company will be closing the stores in Wayne, Trenton, Wall, and Summers Point. Liquidation, the liquidation sales are expected to begin in mid-September, and the stores are planned to close by mid-December. We encourage our customers to continue shopping on Kmart.com for all their product needs, according to a Kmart slash year spokesman, Larry Costello. Costello will not disclose how many employees will be affected by the decision and whether or not they, will, they would lose their jobs or be reassigned. The company has not yet filed a Worker Adjustment and Retraining Notification Act notice with the state. War notices are supposed to be filed, filed by companies at least 60 days ahead of massive layoffs. And then this just goes in about uh, other lose, uh, closures of that Willowbrook Mall. That that one's still going on. So Wayne is getting Wayne is getting hit twice. Wayne got hit last month with Sears closing at Willowbrook Mall in Wayne, and now a month later they're losing their Kmart store in Wayne also. But the only difference is Sears was located at the Willowbrook Mall in Wayne, New Jersey, and Kmart was located at the Wayne Town Center in Wayne, New Jersey. So yes, that means that there will there um where uh, New Jersey is losing four Kmart's. So let me see the locations again. Whoop, did not mean to do that. So the closing stores, Wayne, Wayne, Trenton, Wall, and Summers Point. So let's take a look first at the Wayne Kmart. So this is the last Kmart in Passaic County. Passaic lost their Kmart early uh, last year, right around this time it was finishing off their liquidation sales. But yes, this Kmart located in Wayne, Wayne Town Center in Wayne, New Jersey, uh, will be closing in mid-December of 2019. So this is a pretty basic Kmart. It's very similar looking to the Lodi one. I actually have a friend who goes to this Kmart a lot, and now um, he now knows that it that's, that it's going to be going away. So this is your pretty basic, typical Kmart. It's very similar to the Lodi location, which I got harassed at. Um, just a very basic entrance. You can see, I'll give you guys a few seconds here to admire that. Okay, and moving on. So just more, more a little bit of in-depth of the Kmart uh, sign and the entrance. The entrance is very small. So, but very, this is a very similar Kmart layout to Lodi, except the roof is just a little bit higher. Lodi's is a little bit lower, this, uh, the roof and the ceiling. So yeah, that's the Kmart sign. Um, I think over here, I think this is another, oh, that, that's, that, I think that's just an emergency exit. And of course we have the uh, Kenmore, Craftsman, and Die Hard brand. And these are all brands that are owned by Sears, which became part of Kmart when they both merged back in 2005. So some very interesting details right there. I do not believe this Kmart has a garden center. I think this was probably it over here. Um, they might have they might have had an auto center at one point too, and it looks like that has sadly been uh, walled off. It looks like, and this was probably the garden center. You know, this Kmart and Wayne and Lodi are both very similarly laid out, but I think the garden center was axed off. I think this was part of it at one point too. So, anyways, oh oh okay, the garden center's back here. There's a little like roof building over here. And then the garden center is over here, which is very small, obviously. But this is the garden center right over here. And then back here, it's just it's just a loading dock and stuff. If you wanted to really see a loading dock of the Kmart, then here you go. That's a, that's the loading dock for the store. But nothing too exciting or special. So, this is it in, in a 3D view, and um, if we go over here, I think that's a garage of some sort and like a door. Um, and over here, looks like some plants over there. Um, if we go over here really quickly, I think this might have been some other uh, business, I guess. 
and some Kmart shopping carts, obviously in a carousel, I guess. But yeah, this, uh, this Kmart will be going away uh, December 2019. I might actually consider taking a visit to the store with my friend. I don't know, I gotta, like I said, I gotta talk to him about it, so. But yeah, this is Kmart right here. Just the, this is like the uh, front facade of the store. Looks like it might have been two stores at one point. Um, I, pr I do expect this Kmart to most likely be uh, split in half with a couple of other stores considering they're redeveloping this whole shopping center. But it's a real shame that this Kmart is going away and the fact that Kmart, and, and Kmart will no longer have a single store left in Passaic County after that day. Meaning if you want to go to Kmart, you got to come all the way over to Bergen County in Westwood, one of the last seven reigning Kmarts in New Jersey after that day. So this is the Kmart pretty much. This is just the lip. And then we go over here. This is the back. This is the, uh, what's it called? The loading dock and the stock room all back here. And then the little garden center back here too. So anyways, I think you guys get the idea. So the next Kmart that is closing is the Kmart store. We're going to go a little bit south, um, right down Interstate 95. And that is the Kmart store uh, located in Trenton. It's just, it's literally just outside of Trenton. Um, at the Hamilton Plaza, this is right around where uh, Quaker Bridge is. Um, we'll get a, I guess, I guess we'll get a quick view of this Kmart store. Um, very similar to the uh, Wayne Kmart, except uh, the garden center is on the left instead of it being on the right. It's just a very basic Kmart, like I said, kind of an older, now hiring, more like now closing. Um, like I said, very similar looking store. Um, so, and oh, and I think this one has a pharmacy, unlike. The Wayne store, but it looks like their pharmacy has been discontinued. It looks like they took it away. So, we got the Kmart sign over here. This is the entrance right here. Let me actually get, get go back a little bit and I'll let you guys get a view of that entrance. Very nice. All right. And then over here, like I said, very similar, like rides, like Wayne, a little bit, yeah. So, got some garden stuff along the way here. And then it looks like an old, an, oh yeah, very similar garden shop layout. They, this one may have actually lost their garden shop. I, I think it must have been, it probably was much bigger at a time. And this was probably the auto center, which looks like has been closed for many years. Like very like bad infrastructure it looks like the, the building has definitely been falling apart so it makes total sense for them to close this store we now accept the Merit, Merit Group Medicaid oh wow there's a beautiful Kmart sign back there too very nice oh oh this one doesn't even have a garden center anymore it's just used for storage that's kind of sad I guess but anyways so I guess we'll get a 3d view of it uh, closing I guess Sorry if I'm making this video quick, but I'm just, I mean, I just, I'm just making it quick and simple. So this is the Kmart store over here. This used to be a, the auto part of the Kmart store in the garden shop. So that's the lip right there. Over here used to be the old uh, tool and tires auto service. I'm surprised it wasn't, oh no, it, oh, I think it was under Sears. I'm not sure. Um, and it looks like the garden shop before they be, uh, decommissioned it. And there's a beautiful looking unique Kmart sign back there, which is nice. So I know it's there's not really a lot to view here, guys. I mean, and I don't want to bore you with uh, what's it called? The stock rooms and stuff. But if you wanted to see the stock room, the backside of the loading dock really quickly, then here it is. Sorry if it's quick. I just I just don't want to spend too much time. But like I said, there's four uh, two more stores I have to go over that are closing. But yeah, that's the loading dock. So, anyways, um, I just wanted to take a look at the Wayne one really quickly before I. I wanted to see if there was if there was like a pharmacy up in the Wayne one. Sorry about that, guys. Just wanted to double check really quickly, and then I'll get to the next one that's closing. I don't think I don't. Did this Kmart have a pharmacy? I'm not sure. No, this one did not have a pharmacy. Okay, all right. So the next Kmart that closed, that is, I'm sorry, that is going to close is the Kmart store located in Wall, 
uh, Township, New Jersey. Also, by the way, as for the Kmart store in Hamilton, your best bet is workers are going to be offered to transfer to the one in uh, Doylestown, Pennsylvania. Um, but yes, Kmart is closing another location. Tom's River Kmart already closed, um, but that means after that there's only going to be one left in Ocean County. Or no, I, th I think this one closed too. I'm not sure. Is this, is this the right one? Let me see. West Long Branch. No, that's not it. That is not the one. I need the one in Wall. Okay. Okay. So this Kmart is also closing too. This is the one in Wall. I believe this one does not have a garden center. This one's a much smaller one, so we can get through it much quickly. Okay. Perfect. It's not the best view, but it'll do. So this is just the front entrance. This is a little bit of a newer Kmart, by the way. Um, but yeah, here it is. This is the Kmart store right here. Just the facade and stuff and the sign. So anyways. Moving on. Okay, this one also has a garden shop. See, that's the sign for the garden shop. So let's see if we can find the garden shop. This is just more of the Kmart store. I don't think there's anything else this way. I don't know. But yeah, this is this is more of the Kmart store. So let's go ahead and that's the entrance again. Garden shop sign. Oh, this is a little bit of a newer garden shop, believe it or not. Very unique looking and much, much cleaner looking than the, than the other two. Um, but we'll give you guys a few seconds here to admire that. So, anyways... It's really interesting, though, that all these Kmart stores are closing. It's a it's a real shame, too, but like I said, remember how I was saying, like, they're going to close more stores? Well, this was the uh, August surprise, I would say. But, yeah, this is the rest of the uh, garden shop over here. And then if we pin around here, uh, that's the uh, loading dock over there. So, anyways. Um... Garden shop. Okay. Okay, and the last Kmart that is closing within the state of New Jersey um, is the Kmart store uh, located in Summers Point, which is right near Atlantic, uh, Atlantic City, by the way. Or, I'm sorry, Ocean City, not Atlantic City. <laughs> and the Little Caesars with inside the Kmart as well is, is also expected to close. What a shame though, it really didn't have to go out like this for Kmart. Bit of a newer store, interesting facade. This might have been a super Kmart at one point, or a big Kmart. Well, probably like all the others, they were all big Kmarts and then they were downgraded. This one too, I guess at one point had uh, two entrances. It looks like they, they it looks like they've been closing a lot of the pharmacies inside the Kmart stores. It's a real shame, but what are you gonna do? I don't think this one has a garden center though, um, and I don't think we can get a 3D view of it because it's. Oh no, we can. Okay. So this is it. This is the Kmart store. Um, oh, garden center. Right. Let's get a view of that quickly. So this is the Kmart Garden Center. Like I said, a lot much better looking than the last one we just looked at and the other two that we looked at. So this is the garden center of the Kmart store. A um, bunch of leaves and stuff. Not a bunch of leaves, I'm sorry, plants. What am I thinking? Um, but yeah, this is the garden center. And then over there is the main entrance of the Kmart store. So, and then I guess if we... There's the Kmart sign. And I believe the Little Caesars... Um, is also expected to uh, shut down after this Kmart ceases to operate. And then I believe the um, stock room, I'm sorry, it's, it gets really loud in here. <laughs> Unfortunately, I'm not in my house, 
So I have to kind of be like quiet. Uh, this is the loading dock right here for this Kmart store. Um, and then over here is the main entrance of the Kmart store. And this is the garden center right here. And it looks like some parking too for that garden center. So anyways, yeah guys, so that's about gonna do it for this uh, Kmart video. Uh, yes, it's four of them closing. Wayne, Trenton, um, Wall, and Summers Point, meaning only seven will be left in the state. As for transfers, I think the Kmart store, if you're, I guess, near Ocean City and Atlantic City, well, I'm sorry, you are out of luck. Um, I do not think there's another position to transfer. I think that's the last Sears holding store in the southern part of the state. Um, I could be wrong, though. Let me see. Could be wrong. Yeah, I think that's it. So if you're down here in South Jersey, sorry, you are out of luck. Um, this Kmart and Tom's were also closed as well, I think, earlier this year. Um, I believe there will not be transfer opportunities for this Kmart. Um, as for the one closing in Wall Township, I could probably see some workers getting shifted to Sears at Freehold or the Kmart store in West Long Branch. As for the Kmart store in Wayne, or I'm sorry, uh, Trenton, uh, your best bet is probably going to be the Kmart store in Doylestown, or near um, Doylestown, Pennsylvania. And as for the workers at the Kmart store, uh, located in Wayne, New Jersey, your transfer store will either be West Orange or Westwood. Those are the two best bets, or even Sears at Rockaway, which is still in business, believe it or not, but that's a video for another time. So anyways, guys, I know this was quick and short. Sorry if I didn't do every anything and everything, um, but it's just four Kmarts that are closing. It's not really anything exciting. You know, sometimes you get sick and tired of doing videos almost every day because there's a new store closing almost every day. But yes, this is what I like to call the August Surprise from Transform Hold Co. LLC. But these Kmart stores will begin there, uh, the four of them at least in the state of New Jersey, uh, will begin their liquidation sales in mid-September and are planning to close by mid-September. I'm, I'm sorry, mid-December. So beginning next mid mid beginning mid next month and closing in mid-December. So, anyways, guys, thank you again for watching. Uh, anyways, guys. That's about going to do for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to check the link in the description below. And anyways, guys, thank you again for watching this video. Hope you enjoyed this video, and that will be it.